Hello everyone and welcome, I'm Michael B. I hope you are doing great today. If you're new to this channel, please consider to subscribe and or leave a comment. And while we are at it, smack that like button and the notification bell too. I will surely bring you more videos on simulation, survival and strategy games every week. If you've been here before, welcome back! Hello fellow farmers, welcome back to the wild wild west. Today I got six mobs for you that I want to show and uh, we are preparing to move on to another map. So let's dive into the first mod today. It's what I found on Giant's Mod Hub. It's called a Bell Chipper. So you'll find this Bell Chipper under placeables and it's uh, merely 50,000. It can do uh, bales. It shows square bales. And what is that? Grass, hay. Yeah, grass and hay and silage, bales, wood chips and straw. So that's pretty awesome. And next mod I'll show you is the uh, Class Torian Depth Mule. And uh, hold on, we did that the last time? Yes, we did. But this one, this one has been modified a little bit. And uh, I'm just going to take a look in wheel loaders. Here, we can see we get a slightly better price, just 100,000 off. And we got custom colors. Look at this, how awesome. We get it in hot pink if we'd like to, because why not? And just all around. And same kind of wheel setup as in game. But we have custom colors. How cool is that? But that's not all. If we're gonna take a drive around in the original one, you can notice uh, the turning can be a little, little slow sometimes. I'm used to driving around with this, so not only I compensate, but you can see when you're doing with the keyboard, it's just a little wonky. Much better with a wheel, but um, not everybody plays with a wheel, right? So if we're gonna take this one, it's been tweaked a little bit. And you can notice the how fast it turns now. I mean Yeah, it handles a little bit better. Some like this, some don't like it. I don't know. I uh, need to play around with it a lot more. Because I'm used to the uh, the old one, but uh, I can see the benefits. So yeah, if you want something uh, that goes a little bit faster around the yard, that is definitely an option, and you can get it in custom colors. That's pretty cool. So now we're here, we just need our trustworthy Kenworth. And last time around, we played around with this, and uh, it was supposed to give us a... It, it's called the manure station, or yeah, manure filling station. It holds uh, a digestate and slurry. And this one has been, it's been modified, so it uh, can now give water that's really nice so uh, you can just hit R and it says water yes please Let's fill it up with water Whoop, that, there we go that was quick cool now I um, had hoped that uh, it was you no know, just different color for instance blue um, so we don't mix it up <laughs> that would be terrible yuck so we'll find that under miscellaneous and it's right here water station and the only difference is this uh, can take uh, f uh, give you water and the other one we showed last time was this one the manure loader so that's the only difference but it's pretty cool it doesn't it's a uh, it's another addition and i like it it's uh, yeah, something different we got another one we got this cool thing here the ural 44202 it's uh it's something different. It's pretty cool. I like the sound and uh, it does the job. So of course you'll find it on our trucks and uh, let's see what this bad boy can do. We've got bumper bumper types one and two. So we've got a little headlights there and we got many, many, many different kinds of wheels set up. So that's pretty awesome. And then we also have some main colors from light beige to orange, if that's what you like to do or gray even. Reasonable price, 39,000, and uh, yeah, 240 horsepower. You get what you get. Look at this, we can open the hood. Yank. How awesome. Little inspection. Everything is uh, working out as intended. So I really like that. Just because, and 
on the back here or oh, attached to it we got this big brick <laughs> as i call it it's a it's a dorsey uh chip van as they call it uh it can hold wood chips i just like it because you know it's something dedicated for wood chips because why not and you'll find it under forestry equipment and not under trailers as you might think there we go wood chip wood chip trailer i mean it holds all the different kind of fruit types that is on the map so um yeah it i guess it's just another trailer but it can hold wood chips forty thousand uh, liters of wood chips that's pretty awesome that that's quite the amount so again something different and uh, we can play around with the colors if we like rim colors very good and also the main color you can get it in blue i just got it in brown because you know wood tree that kind of stuff yeah twenty nine thousand yeah cheap as chips <laughs> uh, sorry right well, that's pretty awesome and just because we are trying to get rid of this uh silage here the fermented silage um i just wanted to i don't know, show off this millet machine again millet machine or the phrases as you call it you'll find it under miscellaneous tools and merely five thousand euros and it can uh, distribute a lot of various fill types and internal capacity five million that uh, should do it so how are we going to use it well let's, let's take a look i mean there's there's many kind of uh, different uh, variants of this uh, out there you can find uh, so one can be as good as the other uh, it'll be increased internal capacity or it will be you know just the width or width it's gonna pick up pick up your materials just slap it on the front of the uh, of a tractor and turn it on lower it down and and start collecting i mean this is a uh, for some liking this is a bit slow doesn't collect as fast uh, i just like you know just a nice and easy pace just taste of uh, of realism right now it doesn't shoot out anymore because uh, i guess the trailer is full um but as i said the uh, internal capacity is very very huge I just like this mod very much because uh, you can uh, empty out your silos pretty, pretty darn fast. So now we need a uh, good cleanup. Uh, we need to, I don't know, get ready to move on and we need to sell some of this stuff here, clean out this silo and yeah, I think we're going to leave this for the next uh, next farmer that's going to take over. So uh, maybe we're going to bring some of the mods over for the next map. Maybe we're gonna bring nothing at all. I don't know. It's gonna be interesting to find out, huh? <laughs> right. Let's go sell some stuff. The place that's gonna take most of the things, or not all. It's just next to the shop down here. Okay. Cool. Right. See you down there. Right. Change the tractor. I mean, the Ford can pull it, but it went so slow. So, uh, it's always a good option to have the Trisex. And uh, can we even do this? Without uh, having uh, to fight around with the, uh, I think we have to do this, right? I remembered something a uh, long time ago. <laughs> you said you would take them. Come on. There we go. Get in with you. Ah, uh, yep. Ah, six thousand for that lot. That's okay. Yes, look at that. Whoop! There we go. That was much easier. Almost ten thousand. Hmm. Very nice. Yeah, it's gonna be a little sad to leave this map. I've really fallen in love with the grass textures. It's so colorful and vibrant and oh yeah. Yeah, we've been here for a long time. Definitely not anything wrong with that. I just think it's time to move on. Experience some new stuff and yeah, please ignore those bales. Thank you. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna take care of that later. Don't worry. I'm gonna uh, empty this out. You're gonna have a little time left, maybe. And uh, yeah, so please hang on while we're cleaning all this stuff up.
That was a really strange acting silo. I hope you saw that. <laughs> well, we got it all. That didn't take that long. Awesome. So what I'm thinking we can do is just to place this here. Right. And get over here. And let's see, uh, we can't unload it because my silage is not a part of a silo. So who wants to buy a lot of maize silage, mice silage, corn silage, whatever. Maize silage, fresh. I don't know why I do have to write fresh. I mean, is it bad? I want to sell you some bad maize. Some old uh, bale sales as well. All right, well. Can we, um, can we do a, fo oops, sorry, can we do a follow me thingy, I think that could be great, do I have that installed, I don't, do I, nope, ah, don't have follow me installed, all right, well, first of all, we're going to take this bad boy down to the bale sales. Hang on. I really like this one. It's very realistic. It goes slowly, acceleration. Once it gets going, it gets going. Might be a little too small for this uh, break here, but yeah. Definitely something we need to play around with in the future, I think. So what I wanted to, oh, take care, got the horn, nope, <laughs> whoa, so what I wanted to do is back this bad boy up and see if uh, we can unload, and if we're lucky, the millet machine's gonna start shooting into the, uh, the trailer here, and then we can unload in one go, maybe, I don't know, oops, It's a break! <laughs> Crying out loud. Alright, a little bit more. Oi! Yep, sorry! A ghost of barn. A little bit further. A little bit further. So you're gonna race or you're just gonna empty out in the back? I don't know. Let's try it. We're gonna empty out in the back, cool. Are you gonna unload? No, nope, you're not. Come on. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, It's too far away. Really? Well, let's do something about that. There we go. That's what I wanted. Yep, there we go. That's what I wanted to see. The money is pouring in. It's gonna take a while. And there we go. Half a million liters of maize silage. How much is that gonna bring us? 131,000. Really good. Really, really good. Who wants some eggs? Eggs, eggs, eggs. The dairy. Where's the dairy? That's just down there. Oh, pretty conveniently close. And 10,000. Wow. All right. Here we go. Express delivery, express. <laughs> all right, stop. Oh, we're selling already. Wow. All of you? Nope. What about the last one. Yeah, we are gonna. We have gonna have these. Uh, yeah, these can be reused, so we don't have to buy new ones. Cool. It's all of them. Yep, all of them. Come on. 
Well, you... Damn it. You're very difficult, are you now? No. Oh, come on. Is that it now? Looks like it. Jeez. Right. There's the Xboxes. We're just gonna leave this be as is. Um, yeah. Perfect. So I think that was it for this time around. I'm gonna bring some mods over, as I said. Uh, at least a Tri-6 and maybe also this one here. So we got a little bit of equipment to play around with if we need to do some farm stuff. Maybe the Millet, the Brooks as well. Wherever that is gone, I don't know. Uh, some of the trailers have become quite fond of. Uh, the Radon. Yeah, they're not here right now. Well, unless this is one of them. I think it is. Yep, yeah, I do like these Radon dumpster. Oh. Dumper, oh, what do you call it? Dumper, 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 dumper. While I've been recording, I have gotten a map in my head. It's just been released on Giant's Mud Hub. It's an uh, old friend of mine. I uh, tried it before, way back in 17. So I'm really looking forward to it. It's quite fun. It's got multi fruit, and I thought we could play around on that map with um, with new mods. So, and you are more than welcome to come with suggestions. I would love suggestions on which map we should play around with and look, take a deeper look at a little mini review something like that i don't know um but yeah that'll be it for this time around and also uh bye bye wild west we have had some good times now it's time to move on we might come back who knows we've done it before um yeah so i thank you very much for watching i really appreciate it and until next time then please take care stay safe and be cool bye